everybody. We're talking security today. Of course, big conference going on uh, right now, Veronica, the RSA conference and uh, in out in California, of course, and the trends in security, that's one of the big things we're always talking about at these conferences and afterwards, some of the things that uh, are hot topics. What are you finding out here? Yes, so my in inbox has been full of full. security <laughs> emails and meeting requests. And so one of the most interesting things I've heard so far is um, text-based uh, phishing attacks. Mm -hmm. And they actually call it smishing. Smishing, so okay. So SMS plus phishing. So basically someone would, you would get a, a link on mm -hmm. your, in, your, in a text that to click on something for a deal or an offer or whatever. And um, it's actually a link to malware and can, you know, if you keep going, it could take you to a bad site and you could share your information mm -hmm. and then you would, you know, have potential data loss and things like that. I was talking to one security expert and he said, unless you've talked to somebody in the last hour, don't click on any links mm -hmm. that you get via text, which right. I thought was pretty, <laughs> it's pretty sad. It's sad that but, that's uh, what it's right, come to, right. but no be, surprise. <laughs> yes. So that was really interesting, this mm -hmm. new wave of attacks that uh, corporations are need to watch out for. And then another thing that I had from another study was about data ownership. Mm -hmm. And they were looking at insider data breaches. So, you know, someone who works for a company and either accidentally sends it to someone else or some or someone who works for a company and takes the data with them when they leave and like intentionally breaks company policy. And um, they surveyed about 500 IT managers and about 1,000 employees. And they found that directors were actually the most likely to take data with them and leave the company like with Like the it. management level yes, is where they're saying. Yes. Hmm. And the report authors were speculating that um, if you're working remotely or you're working from home, mm -hmm. you have a more sense of ownership around the data. And you think, well, I built this data or I analyzed this uh -huh. data, so it's mine. So maybe they thought maybe that's why people were intentionally breaking company policy and sharing data with people it shouldn't be shared with. And so. we're seeing more and more working from home, you know, no right. doubt. That's right. the trend. Exactly. And another part, another um, uh, report that I was reading recently was about mental health and burnout on the security team mm -hmm. because it's a lot of stress. You're always staring at a screen. You know, if you let something through, it could be a big breach for your company. And actually, one of the themes of the conference out in San Francisco is the human element of security. Mm -hmm. And I was reading a report about burnout, and um, they had some really, some of the advice was really touchy-feely, like show gratitude, like yeah. say, you know, thank you for your work, or just be, be gracious to your, yeah. your employees and your colleagues. And something else was um, enforce vacations, actually make sure people Be told you've got to take the time. Yes. So yeah. um, it'll be interesting to hear. You know, hear discussions of mental health because obviously it's a high stress job, and but it's a really important one. Yeah, so. most definitely. And as we know from you know all of the stories and conversations we have, that they they cannot fill the roles fast enough. There's just such a need for security experts. Right, right. and there's a lot of talk about automation, like doing mm -hmm. some of the low level screening, but you always need a human to say, oh, you know, this is around the election, which is happening in a week, and that's why spammers right. are trying to target this. So. So it'll be interesting to watch people find the balance between automation and, and humans still being in charge and contributing a lot to the process. Yeah, and got to keep mental health top of mind, right? In every industry, in that's every for industry. sure, <laughs> uh, for all of us. All right, well, for much more on the conference, uh, make sure you check out Veronica's articles, all that more on Tech Republic. Thanks for watching.